Hey guys, welcome to the final uh, episode of this playthrough for uh, Sid Meier's Railroads. Um, there are other scenarios, obviously, but these are for multiplayer, I'm pretty sure, so I'm not going to do them. I'd rather, uh, this one could be interesting, actually, but, but it's, uh, the objectives are all just be the last railroad standing, so I'm not going to do them. Uh, we're going to do Germany. So this scenario covers much of southeast Germany and the surrounding lands, including Frankfurt, Hamburg, Nuremberg, Cologne, and Berlin. It covers the time period of 1835 to 1980. The trains of this scenario are slanted towards the diesel and electric, so that late era is recommended for most players. Are there any uh, scenarios that are recommended for uh, just players of difficult uh, means? I don't know, whatever I'm trying to say, but whatever. Um, we're playing a mogul hard, we're gonna have one AI again. I think I've, after whatever, uh, 25 hours of playing this game roughly, I figured out the main issue I have with it. And that's the fact that the AI is only in the game to try to save up to buy you out on a certain difficulty. Once you get to a higher difficulty, that's all they try to focus on, which is obviously uh, challenging, but when you get to the fact that they don't have to do objectives. Not that we have to do objectives technically either, but that's obviously the point of the game. You want to do the objectives. So the problem they have, or the game has, is that while I'm here trying to spend money doing uh, these objectives, their AI gets to a certain point where they just start saving money up so they can buy you out. And if you have more than one AI, it becomes extremely diff difficult to try to like stay alive when they could just literally one person just saves you up you could buy two of them out but the third one's been saving since the beginning while well, you've been trying to do objectives and whatnot and they buy you out so i guess that's my main issue with the game why the other railroad tycoons i think worked better the year is 1835 and the famous der adler the eagle locomotive has made its maiden voyage from nuremberg to firth all across germany private companies are formed to finance new railroad construction or new railroad construction in 10 years there'll be 2000 Kilometers of railroads in the country. Ten years after that, the lumber will more than quadruple. For now, however, the countryside of Germany is blank canvas. Is a blank canvas waiting to be painted with steam and rails. Okay. Make history in Saxony by connecting. Oh, so we have 35 years by connecting Dresden with connecting Leipzig, Dresden with Berlin. Okay, so we're already connected with Dresden, so we just got to connect to Leipzig and Berlin. And then help Dresden's growth as a commercial hub by delivering 15 carloads of passengers and mail from Berlin. So, 15 carloads of passengers from Berlin to Dresden, 15 carloads of mail from Berlin to Dresden. Okay. Impress your shareholders by hitting a worth of 5 million. Currently, we are at 1. Okay, so let's just go ahead. Where's Berlin? Berlin's here. Where's Leipzig? Here's my fucking least favorite part of the game, is trying to find the cities. Alright, so this is simple enough. Um, might as well just connect to Berlin right off the bat. This is actually a really good start. Do this. And we'll just go back and forth. Um, let's see, so they do, they make automobiles, so they need steel, so we need a steel mill. This is just a power plant, unfortunately. Ooh, what's this? Tags? Big farms. So obviously we'll connect Dresden to Prague here, eventually. Let me just double check, it was Berlin to Dresden, because we're supposed to grow Dresden, okay. That's fine. Looks like Prague. So Otto von Bismarck is like pretty much right next to me. He's already connected to Leipzig because he started in Prague. Hmm. So our goods here. Passengers are not bad. Mail's the worst, but it's still a decent amount.
Not sure why I got so much for that. It'd give me like 30,000. Connect the Leipzig. We have just enough to do it. This kind of messes up them, I think, so now they can't really make any more rails going that way. Let's just connect. We got that uh, objective out of the way real quick. I want to connect these rail lines real quick to avoid future congestion. And we can make a, we can make a little train that goes from here, just do something like that, and then yeah, There's something I can do make us a little bit of cash on the side for now. I do want to connect that pig farm. And there's another one here. I can connect both of them. But I really should buy that slaughterhouse. Stock carry, sorry. Um, let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> This is going to be a huge earn for us. Food is always a good earner. Obviously, I don't think they're going to be as inclined to put in for this because there's no uh, pigs going in there, so why would they? Obviously, this train isn't going to net too much because these trains are already kind of in there. So he didn't even make one bid. So we own that stockyard, which is good. Oh, he already connected. Shit. Oh, you know what? That's actually good. Now we're going to make money off of it. So good for us. Okay, let's connect to here. We didn't really need to uh, have this connected, but so be it. Run across. I think it'll be better if we do that. We don't have the money yet. <clears throat> How are we looking here? We uh, we delivered the passengers. Now we just got to do the mail, but we have plenty of time. So. so it's a lot cheaper for you to stake this road, actually. So let's do that. I'm going to try to block him as much as I can. Let's go ahead and make that. Now we'll make a train that just delivers all this stuff to Prague. And then I can make a train. <clears throat> Delivers all that food to Dresden. So I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to do. We don't need a pen. We don't have the money right now, but. Burns too sharp, it says. There we go. Alright, so let's make a train that...
And in return, uh, nothing, I suppose. Yeah. We can go ahead and add a double track here. Yeah, this train's unfortunately going super slow. We have a lumber mill where, okay. We can connect uh, some timber there. We'll do that next. <clears throat> so this little clog here is good for us too. Pigs, or swine I should say, it's pretty uh, good the highest of the pre resources at the moment. That's cheating. Unless I just deleted that train. connect to the stockyard because I don't think they're doing enough to bring in food. We'll take as much as we can away from them. Wait until they're full. Deliver that here. Beautiful. So look at our objectives here. Um, we need one more car load of mail. That will be good. We're almost at the five mil mark already, so. Okay. All it's done. Maybe a little crossover there. Yeah, something like that. Okay. We're just going to try to increase our uh, net worth a bit. A bunch of swine are coming into Prague. Now let's connect. Let's make a little double track here. Green. Manufactured goods actually go for a lot more than uh, paper. But is it worth the distance traveled? I don't think it is. Who needs paper? Cologne. 
they demand it for their newspaper. Fortune has a little, that's a bit of a distance for us, isn't it? They're uh, going pretty hard, huh? Spread it fast. Let's buy some of his stock. And some of ours while we're at it. Drive the price a bit. <clears throat> Could connect this grain farm here and then bring all the beer into uh, Berlin. That'll beer goes for a good amount. Same as food. I said about that, I think, but <laughs> we'll buy a judge. Let's, uh, Where's Berlin? They, okay, so they make paper. They make paper and they like beer. We'll connect to that. Okay. So. Bring it here. train that just brings the wait till you're mm. no don't wait till you're full and then deliver that to Berlin gonna need a second track here not enough money we roll a second So he is taking some of our food, which is okay, because we own that stockyard. So we're going to get some more money. So I think we just got our third objective, which means next we're going to recreate the famous flying hamburger line. Ham connect Hamburg to Berlin. Build terminals there and achieve a speed record of transporting passengers from Hamburg to Berlin. Okay. So clearly they want us to connect to Berlin. Clearly. We have enough money now, so we can make it all track there. Frick is hamburger. It's over here, right? Ah, oh, man, he kind of blocked me off, didn't he? Good for him. Uh, Okay, so let's figure out how we can connect. How much time do we have for this? We have a lot of time. It is, yeah, we have 70 years. So I honestly think we can just buy out Bismarck beforehand. And then just connect that way, but let's save up a bit. Start buying some stock. Is there anything over here we can kind of connect to? I think we've gone as far as we can. I'd like to get into the steel business because obviously the money involved there is pretty um, 
helpful. So let's look here. Where's, where can we find some? So Dresden is. It requires steel. Frankfurt makes it. Where's the coal, though? Here, which he already connected to, unfortunately. And there, that's a big one. We can connect to Rotterdam. Ooh, Rotter. Yeah, let's do that. We can get over there. We gotta get the hammer. It's so far away, though. Ugh. We're gonna upload this paper somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, it's just too far away. For it to be profitable, I'm almost better off buying a newspaper. Max is 200, I'll go, but... Ah, oh, shit. Alright, yeah, I'm done. Alright, I'm gonna upgrade my trains. So right now they're just super slow and not really profitable. Or as profitable as they could be. Okay, so I'm not gonna he won this merge plan, but I drove up the price, so that's good. Um, I can make that really profitable. Yeah, let's just go ahead and let's upgrade this to the terminal. Because obviously Berlin's going to be a high, highly trafficked area. Son of a bitch.
There we go. I think that'll work, I don't know. I suppose I'll do the same with Dresden. Pretty sure this is already a terminal because it's my starting spot, so. He's trying to take my brewery. I'm gonna go ahead and just outbid him there. I need roughly six million to buy myself out fully. Paper. So that is a good chunk of change, but we can start delivering just, uh, you know what, we'll do. What? Delete. Where's that trip? This train. When you're going to Berlin, you take paper on the way back. Something like that, I guess. But, oh, let's upgrade this uh, engine with a. Uh, let's do this one. <clears throat> now we have to start focusing on buying him out. I'm gonna go and buy some more of the stock. Is he taking advantage of... Oh, he isn't yet. I really need to get over there. It's gonna cost a lot, though. Hit by the... Trying to take my paper mill. Well, I'll get him again. Anything that's gonna help us kind of like out earn him, I think is worth it for the time being. Actually, this food one, it really isn't doing too much for us. Surprisingly. He must be taking like more of the food. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna kinda stay the course and try to buy him out. Cause he looks like he's saving up money. Like I said, little investments here and there I think are fine, but yeah. I need to buy him out so I can kinda connect our lines a bit. I think it's gonna go a long way. Then I can just breeze through the rest of the objectives.
rain gun down a bit, so no beer is back where it was. Alright guys, I'm going to take a quick break. Stay tuned for the next episode.